Hello, my name is Tarun Agarwal and I am MLM Automation Expert. In this video, I'm going to tell you how you can uh, how you can have multiple funnels using Kajabi without having this restriction of pipelines, without using pipeline because in, in your Kajabi plan, you may have restrictions about how many pipeline you can create. But yes, you can create multiple funnels, unlimited funnels. How to do it, do that? I'm going to tell you in this, in this short tutorial. <clears throat> so to create a funnel using Kajabi, you need all these things. Okay, landing page, one thank you page, one form, one event and one email sequence. So let's go step by step. First of all, go to uh, log into your Kajabi website, Kajabi portal, and then go to website and then click on pages and uh, click on new page and Kajabi. Uh, the great thing about Kajabi is it gives us so many um, existing pages, okay, uh, landing pages, which are already prepared and you can use, use any of these. Okay. Say for example, I'm using this one streamline home just for an example. I'm not, I'm not, I'm not going to edit this. Just for the test purpose, I'm just going to use this uh, as a demo. Okay. Now click on get started. And suppose I, I'm calling it a webinar registration. Okay. And then click on create. So number one step is landing page. So this is a landing page, which you can create by using this template. Okay. So this is step number one. In the meantime, yeah. Okay. Let it let it load it okay so from here <clears throat> you can do the editing you can customize it add new element change the events and all those kind of things you can do right okay so let's go back okay let's go back yeah, let me open kajabi in the another tab Okay, so these are the elements which we can customize. You can change the name and all these kind of things. So let's go back to the main home page of this portal. Next step is to create a thank you page. Okay, so now click on new page. Okay, new page and uh, use any of these. Okay, so for example, I'm using this one. So these are some new pages. Uh, launched by Kajabi recently in the new update and suppose webinar thank you page suppose I'm calling this and then click on create so this is a new thank you page which I'm creating now so we need a landing page we need a thank you page and then we need a form we have to create a new form where we will capture all the leads okay so for this Let me open Kajabi in the other tab also. Okay, let it go on this page only. Okay, fine. So this is a thank you page. All right. Now let's go back. Let's go back. And now we have to create a form. So go to marketing. Okay, go to marketing and now what I'm doing, I'm just opening this is a new in a new tab and uh, here I'm opening an event. Okay, so we need a form. We need a form and then we need a we need an event. So click on event and then click on new event and create a new event from here. Okay, it means you just have to set the time. Okay, webinar. You can say webinar and time and date you can choose like suppose 17th and then apply okay and then click on save so before the event and after the event what you can do you can set up some email sequences from here so this fifth point is email sequence so email sequence can be set using event only so you can okay this is the event date and time click on add email and in add email what you can do you can choose before the event subject okay congrats yeah you can say uh, when at the time of registration once a person registers for this then congrats you are registered okay and this is a congratulations kind of message and uh, suppose you are doing a webinar then you can share your webinar details here 
after creating this event uh, you can set up all the email uh, you can add more email before the event and after the email like say for an example i'm adding one more email here so when at at the time of registration we have already added then at the time of event before the event and after the event so suppose after the event i want to write an email uh, say for example uh, okay after the event how how many days how many hours later say for example two hours later i want to send an email like thank you okay suppose thank you message thank you and you can just type thank you thank you for attending the event like this thank you message and instructions after the event so this way you can add multiple emails before the event after the event okay so this is the event which you have to create and uh, you can share your zoom details and webinar details in your emails okay at the time of registration um, you can share the uh, webinar details zoom details on the email only now next step is you have to create a form okay so under marketing go to forms okay so what we have done so far we have created a landing page thank you page we have created an event and under event we have email sequences now what we have to do uh, we have to capture all the leads in a single in a single form so in that case go to marketing click on form and then click on new form and suppose i want to create a form here webinar registrants okay webinar webinar leads say for example okay and then click on save so this way a new form will be created and now what we have to do is we just have to enable our automation okay uh, so this is the form name and this is the opt-in detail double opt-in or single opt-in it's up to you you can choose any of these and then uh, form fields you can add name email id suppose if you want to add if you want to have a phone number also then you can add phone number field also here okay like this clear now go uh, what you have to do just click on save so this is a form which is created okay and all what what we have to what we have to do next is we have to go back to website and then go to uh, page the landing page and in landing page what we have to do next is we just have to integrate this form okay this is the webinar registration page click on customize what we have to do is we just have to integrate this form with this registration page okay when we are asking for the information so let's see uh, customize this and then okay <clears throat> then what we do what you have to do is this is call to action on this button okay on this button or else if you go down 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 let's see where are the call to actions this is the call to action so what we have to do on this button click we want to open a form okay we we want to capture the information so what we have to do here click on select a uh, two step opt in pop up okay so you can choose two step opt in pop up like this and for this what you have to do go back and uh, again go back and there is an option two step opt in okay and in this two step opt in what you have to do you just have to select a form and this form which we have just created like webinar webinar leads okay and thank you page once person fills up the form then where you have to take that person is a landing page the thank you page which we have just created which is a webinar webinar thank you page okay webinar thank you page and then click on save so what will happen once a person clicks on that button it will open this uh, double opt in page and whatever information which we capture is going to be uh, on this button click on this button click, click call to action will be two step opt in and then click on save so whenever a person clicks on this button it will open uh, it will ask for the details and those details will be captured by our form like name okay suppose if i click on enter my name and then enter my email id and then if i enter my suppose this is my email id just give me a moment okay and my phone number and then submit so once i submit it i can also change this image okay once i submit this what will happen um, if i go to my form okay it will automatically open the thank you page i can customize this also it is a very good looking thank you page and then if i go here to my forms and if i click on submission
So here I can see uh, the details of those people who have filled up our form in the registration page. Okay. Yes. So I hope you got it. And also what you can do in the registration page, this is, this is one way. Another way is you, what you can do below this here, uh, below this text field, you can also add another content with the name form. Okay. And uh, this will directly open a form and what you can do, click on form and select the form, which we have just created like webinar. Okay, uh, webinar leads. So instead of a button click directly, it will show this information. Once you click, when a, once a person clicks on submit, it will automatically go to go to the thank you page. So on the button click submit, okay, on this button click. So what you can do uh, on this button click, okay, then thank you page, select a, go to the landing page and the landing page which we have created like webinar thank you page this will automatically be open if a person fills form like this. So either on a button click, button click will be two step opt in. And if you have, if you add this kind of form, then on directly on button click, it will be capturing the information and all this information will be saved in the forms. Okay. So go to marketing forms and you can see all the submissions here. Now what else we have to do? Next, what we have to do is we have to send some automated email sequences, okay, uh, before the event and after the event. So under forms, okay, under forms, next step is click on add automation. And now this is the last step that is, once the form is submitted, okay, then register for register to an event and uh, just choose your event webinar. Okay, suppose uh, which one was that? Suppose this is the one, okay, webinar, and then click on save. So what will happen once this form is filled, once this, once this form is submitted, person will automatically be uh, registered to this event. And in this event, we have enabled before the event and after the email, email sequences. So this is the way how you can build unlimited funnels without using pipeline. So pipeline has a, what what pipeline do is pipeline uh, feature of uh, Kajabi. It builds all these things, um, event, form, landing page, thank you page, all these are um, created at once. But if you want to add more and more pipelines like this, funnels, then you can create on your own like this. Okay. I hope you found this entire tutorial valuable. Ultimately, to sum up, you only need a landing page, thank you page, a form, and email and event. Okay. And under the event only you have to write your email sequences. So these are the steps which you have to follow. If you have any kind of question related to Kajabi, then let me know in the, in the chat option, in the comment option below. And also if you want to try Kajabi, then go to DNA club dot in slash Kajabi. So you can try Kajabi for 14 days. Okay. Just check out this website. This is my affiliate link and check out uh, Kajabi. It is, it is a wonderful tool. I have been using this tool for last four years and I am able to automate my network marketing business hundred percent online using Kajabi. So it is a great tool. Just try this out for any question, put your question in the comment box. Thank you very much.